Okay. Um, where's the arcade? This way. Oh, Jesus. So can we... There's a lot to do in this uh, DLC. Hey, it's pretty Shepherd, good. Over here. Thanks for coming by. Good to see you. What's up? Out for a little R and R. You? Exactly. Same thing. Hey, Jacob. I'm out of credits. Tough shit, then, isn't it? Who are they? Their parents are MIA. Volunteered to take them on for the weekend, get their minds off things. What about us, Shepard? There's got to be a game of skill in there with our names on it. Let's do it. Great. Oh, here we go. This is your game of skill? Chatterdizo. Now, Shepard, I'll try not to embarrass you. Really? Trash He's gonna be like a master of this. Hell yeah, my pride is on the line. Also, these kids look up to me, so I have to take you down. You're gonna take me down? Oh, oh. I don't think so. Well, step up, Shepard. Although it might be tough not having your squad to carry you. You're on. Ooh, no pressure, damn, Shepherd. boy. These people already idolize you. So when you choke, it won't matter. You're crowding me. Am I? My bad. Stand back, everyone. Shepard needs extra room to make the magic happen. Ready? I busted Let's my balls, Jacob. Glad none of your friends are here to see your humiliation. Is that all you got? Come on, come on, come on! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Nice one. Okay, okay. That's two out of three. Yeah! Commander Shepard wins! That was pitiful, Taylor. Just, well, incompetent, really. You couldn't just let me win just once? <laughs> well, on, no, Shepard. that would be Scrap disrespectful. I'm buying. <laughs> Look, if you wanted the training wheels on Jacob, you just had to give me the special wink. And, uh, yeah. Oh, wrong way. Have a good evening now. In these troubled times, double the investors the real trust. difficulty, of course, will be getting the pie jacked. Okay, where's the rapid transit? Because if there's a way to get to the Normandy, then it would be one of these, wouldn't it? There's another one at the other side. So yeah, I don't know if we can go there yes, yet. The idea is that the Norman is in refit. That night was... So maybe it's a special thing that we can go to once it's opened up. Now that yeah. Oh. Beautiful car. Oh. Really? Why exactly? Okay. <laughs> Let me quickly save it. Just in case. It's a Mark II Let's see what's here then. Here's another one. Uh, dates back to the Rachni Wars. So, a Krogan and a Salarian have landed on a Rachni world for a top secret mission. That is unlikely. Salarians rarely took part in raids on Rachni occupied I think worlds. I'm directly. Oh, God, I'm stuck again. <sighs> Missing the point. So, the two guys are climbing up a hill going through this nasty green fog. And as they get near the. Commander. So, hang on, hang on. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, I'm stuck. I can't move. That's, see, this is where we save it. <laughs> mm-hmm. Wow. We've had that problem before. If I, I'm not going to stand in that spot again, because... Wow. But no, there's no Rex here. Hmm. Care for a night out? Let's get dressed up. Meet at the casino. She'll be the one in red. 
I'm from Samara. Okay, so she wants to be on the Citadel. Is there any ways to assist you? Do not hesitate to call. So yeah, there's no, there's no Rex here yet. Uh, all right, here's another one. Uh, dates back to the Rachni Wars. So Let's just listen to this anyway. Solarian have landed on a Rachni world for a top secret mission. That is unlikely. Solarians rarely took part in raids on Rachni occupied worlds directly. <sighs> Missing the point. So the two guys are climbing up a hill, going through this nasty green fog. And as they get near the top, they come out of the fog, and the Solarian sees thousands of Rachni. He looks over at the Krogan and says, Oh, well, that makes me nervous! The Krogan says, You think that's scary? When this is over, I have to go back down through that fog by myself! The implication being that the Solarian soldier would be dead. Yes. Thank you for killing the 2,000-year-old joke. <laughs> that joke plays to racial stereotypes on both sides. The Krogan appears brutish and insensitive. While the Solarian appears weak. Yeah, Joker. Stereotypes such as exemplified here led to the development and use of the Genophage. Yeah, think about did well, you? Well, yeah. It's also one of the only jokes you'll hear both Solarians and Krogan telling. Comedy isn't really about being nice. Sometimes it's a way to air out the ugly things people think. Oh dear me. But really, Joker, you're an insensitive asshole. I do want to check my fish while we're here, though, since I know we can come back to the Normandy now. <sighs> okay, somebody's been feeding them. Good. Okay. Oh, that's right. Miranda wants to go to the casino, doesn't she? And I think Samara, we just have to uh, invite so, to the apartment. What do you want to do? Come on in. Right, where is she? Wait for Miranda over here. Oh, that's right, Rex was at the casino bar. We probably have to wait for him to call us then for that first. But that hasn't unlocked yet. The lady in red. Miranda? You clean up well, Shepard. Thought we might try an evening out. Yeah, I just went to the Normandy and just come back, so maybe when we go back to the apartment there'll be a message and then we come back again. Sounds like you have some time to catch your breath. I do, just not used to it. So I haven't been back to the apartment Feeling yet. That's lost. when it triggers, I think. <laughs> it's kind of sad, really. I got to thinking we needed a break. No point saving the galaxy if we can't enjoy it once in a while. I have to say I'm a bit surprised. I thought you might be. I can be, uh, <laughs> severe. Yep. You're focused. Believe me, I understand. I was thinking about our talk earlier. Don't like her gloves. About having a normal life. Damn. Rigged. I'm not very good at this. Truth is, Shepard, I'm not very good at being normal either. Bit of a disaster, really. I get it. How do the little we people manage? Little Any ideas? Mm-hmm. Look around you. It's a room full of great ideas. Here? It's nothing but alcohol, gambling, and wasting time. Uh-huh. 
Shepard's light. <sighs> right. Need more wine. Bring the lady more wine. Oh God, I'm gonna regret this. What's wrong with her hand? Out on the town? Or is What's that just the, the, like, the tips of the gloves? <laughs> Come on, partner. Let's start some trouble. It looked like her hand was <laughs> rotting off then. <laughs> Right. So, yeah, he's not listed on here yet. So I do believe I have to go back to the apartment. But let's just have a peek. What should we do first? What can I get for you? Uh, I'm waiting. Maybe this is it. I was here when Cerberus attacked, and I don't remember seeing you. I think I caught a glimpse of Commander Shepard fighting over by the elevator bay, though. Well, yeah, Shepard was protecting the council, but I had my own problems to deal with. You see, I was down by the docking bay near CSEC headquarters. Ha <laughs> ha! Commander Shepard is chasing the council! This is our chance! Oh god, oh, I love the voice acting. Cerberus. going to stop us <laughs> with finesse what up like this it's joking time oh no <laughs> Oh, this is fantastic. Thank you for pointing this out. I would have totally missed it. Bring it on. Oh! This is great. That's right. You just landed on the island of Dr. Me. What? And that's pretty much how it happened. Which is why you should comp my drinks. Really, Joko? No. <laughs> oh, come on! I barely believe what they're saying about Shepard. You? I don't think so. Okay, trying not to be offended there. Look, if Shepard were here... Uh, Hi. Shepard! Hi! I'ma back him up. I'm Commander Shepard, and I'll vouch for my pilot. Jeff Moreau is a hero. Everyone in this room owes him their lives, myself included. I'm so sorry, Commander. I had no idea. I'm Commander Shepard, and this Drinks is my favorite on bar on the Citadel. Ah. Uh, thanks, Commander. <laughs> you can pay me back later. Yeah, you can get me a drink. <laughs> if you go again to the Normandy, uh, there is Rex there. Oh, really, then? Right. Liquors, ale, spirits, you name it, I got it. Total dad dancing. Oh, jeez. Shepard, you gotta get some new moves, bro. <laughs> no one in this club can dance. Except when we took Tally there. On the last stream. On Monday. She was cutting the rug. Why can't I get downstairs from up here? This is weird. Oh. She actually had some moves. She was out dancing, exactly like, the same as the others. well, Shepard for a start, which isn't really all that difficult, to be honest, as you've just seen, you know. I'm not a great dancer myself, but I could outdance Shepard. Actually, no, I don't think I could. We'd be about the same. Mm, nope, no Rex still. Is he in a different part of the ship? Hmm. 
No, he's not listed yet. Oh, you mean go to the Normandy, come back, and then he'll be in the bar. Right. Okay, cool. Sorry, I'm misunderstanding. So we just do this to leave the zone and reload it. That's what I was thinking, you know, like, would he be on the ship? Because he's not part of the crew, technically, now. I just don't see where the point is. No. All right. You wouldn't. No, that's no problem. So I'm sometimes slow on the uptake as well, so don't worry about it. It moves my very soul that you insist upon ignoring such an illustrious figure as Patriarch. Truly, it does. Is he still good old Patriarch? Oh, here we go. The big guy. Rex? What are you doing here? Uh, escaping. Ever since we cured the genophage, it's been nothing but work. Council been right. I just broke the counter. Ah, not those Pajak shit slingers. No, it's the... It's the female shepherd. Now that they're fertile again. Oh, I haven't slept in I don't know how long. <laughs> oh. Can I get you two anything? Two more drinks. And another bag of ice. I wonder where that's going. Hmm. <laughs> oh dear. I would have thought you'd be enjoying the perks of Krogan fertility. Enjoying it? There's a line of females outside my dwelling right now. It stretches on for as far as you can see. I had to sneak out my own bathroom window. Even then, I was cornered by two more females on the ride from Tuchonka. And it's just you? They're not spreading the love around? Sure, but everyone wants their firstborn in generations to be strong and fit. I'm the leader of Clan Erdnot. I brought an end to the Genophage. Everyone on Tuchanka wants a piece of me. And Bakar is no help at all. She encourages it. Oh, I bet she does. I'm telling you, Shepard, I'm in no shape to fight Reapers. <laughs> Considering everything we've been through, I can think of worse positions to be in. Trust me, I've been in every position in the past few days. <laughs> Here are your drinks. And a bag of ice. Oh. Jesus. I don't even want to know where that's going. <laughs> Shep is like, yep, I'm leaving. Mm. And I thought Morden's procedure was painful. Oh, well. <laughs> Shit, Shepard. We sure have been through it, haven't we? Still going through it. <laughs> True. Well, here's to us. And to going through it. I'll drink to that. Jeez. That's fantastic. Corbal! That means victory or death, roughly. Ah, but you can't die, Rex. You've got a family now. A really big family. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. I love it. That is brilliant. Jeez. Like a shepherd just has to, like, discreetly look away while he stuffs the bag of ice down his front. Jesus. Right, is there anybody else? Nope. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much, Champy, for bringing that to my attention. I might have missed those. I thought we'd done everything. I was like, okay, I guess we had a few encounters and then we throw a party, right? Nope. <laughs> There's a lot more. I had this perfect spot. Long sight lines, good cover, no way to get flanked. 
Oh dear. So I wonder now, does this... No, it doesn't. Okay, I just wondered if maybe it added more throughout the progression, but it doesn't. Okay, it hasn't told me about new messages, but we still have a couple more to do. I think we have to bring Samara up here. And Cortez wants to watch the game with James. Caden wants to hang out. And Trainer wants to hang out. Let's start at the bottom and work our way up. This <laughs> is a table sure <laughs> a shooting game that a house flipping. I can't very well bring it back to the Normandy. I'd have nowhere to put it. This place is amazing. Puts the prefabs back on Horizon to shame. And it has a hot tub. Go ahead. Hmm. Cheers! I was just thinking, you are going to change into like a bathing suit or something, right? You're not just going to dive in uniform and all. Oh, this is lovely. And good for the sinuses. I might not even need my antihistamine tonight. Your what? It's a pill. I'm allergic to dust and cats. And public speaking. I've just been nervous. I take a proton pump inhibitor for my stomach, too. And an inhaler for asthma. Damn, so what you're saying is you're quite the hypochondriac. <laughs> Do you have everything you need to stay healthy? Just about. The only medication I can't find is sucrocapsinol. My family doctor prescribed it for my headaches. Sucrocapsinol? That's Got a, a sugar health filter, problems. A placebo. Oh, that sneaky bastard. <laughs> and now that you've told me, it probably wouldn't work anyway. There was some scented bath oil out there somewhere. Could you grab it? I know, right? She just jumped in yeah. in her underwear. Like, here you go. But then again, I suppose she didn't Thanks. expect there to be a hot tub. Eyes are over here and up here. <laughs> hey, do you have a loofah? Uh, a loofah. What did your last slave die on? This is Anderson's apartment, remember? I highly doubt he has it. Found one. Somebody left an overnight bag with toiletries and massage oils and, you know, girly stuff. Do you know who Kay Sanders is? She has great taste in adjustable massage ones. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's Anderson's friend uh, that we helped rescue. Right, where is she then? Is she like hanging out in the apartment now? I'm just wondered. Uh, no, I can't see her. She's not a hypochondriac. Hypochondriac is a person who lives with the fear that they have a serious undiagnosed illness. She just has allergies. That's true. It was a bit mean of me to say it like that. Oh god, hang on, look. That's the thing we won in the grabber game. Cool. But yeah, she's not chill. She's actually probably still up in the jacuzzi, isn't she? I'm just kind of wondering if they still stick around in the apartment after the fact. Hmm, I guess not all of them do. Okay, cool. Let's invite another one. It is a big apartment, isn't it? Yeah. I came as quickly as I could. What's wrong? I didn't mean to worry you. When I saw you were on the Citadel, I wanted to see you again. We've said our farewells, Shepard. And now we say hello again. These big picture windows remind me of our talks in the Normandy's observation lounge. This view doesn't have quite the same effect as a galaxy of stars, but I can see where it might make one sentimental. I also enjoyed our talks, Shepard. Very much. Hey, look what I found. An old issue of Justicar Heroes, May 2140. It says that you personally lifted 50 refugees across a raging floodplain on Nevos after smugglers blew up a dam. That 
news source has been known to exaggerate. So you didn't almost drown while saving a child who had been torn from her mother's grasp? The smugglers were not so lucky that I survived. Are there more stories like this? Perhaps. You might be amused by the June 2085 issue, Justicar Samara, Cold-Blooded Justice Runs Hot. It is not so difficult for me to find stories of your exploits. I think that you are remarkable, Shepard. When the vids sing your praises and call you a hero, does it make you blush? Do you agree? What do you feel? Strokes the ego. It's humbling. But honestly, if people feel that I'm making a difference, that bolsters me, my team, and our efforts. She's sitting on her hands. What now? She kind of looks like she is, I doesn't she? I am content she? as we are, Shepard. Let us sit a while longer. Even if there is nothing to say. Yeah, she kind of did look like she just parked herself on top of her hands. Hey, Shepard, I'm starving. What do you got? We're heading out, Caden. I'm so tired of Apollos. I'm gonna cook. Oh, no. Really? <laughs> Come on. He's like, oh no. You what? want me to sit there and watch you cook? <laughs> you're not watching me cook. You're helping me drink beer. Now sit your ass down. What are we having? Canadian delicacy of some sort? Steak. Uh, sure. Exactly. We have uh, beef, we have bacon, we have beer. The foods of my people. Wish me luck. If you need luck to cook us dinner, we're screwed. Screwed? <laughs> Grown. Oh, yeah. You hurt me, Shepard. If he starts drizzling it's maple syrup over the steaks, then we really, we'll find out. you know, like, oh god. So, remember how I saved the Citadel? And then, well, you weren't there. I survived a suicide mission? All these close calls I've had, only to be taken out by dinner. Can it at least be quick and painless? <laughs> Funny. And you think I hauled your butt out of the fire all those times just to poison you here now? I just took down my clone. I gotta figure anything's possible. Huh. Do we have hot sauce? That was great. Still waiting for the botulism to kick in. <laughs> yeah, I thought I was pretty good. Actually, it was pretty good. I'm impressed. Thank you. I'm an enigma. I've got skills. I mean, for example, fist fight, me and James, I'd, I'd win, right? And what if I fought dirty? Well, we won a fist fight against James, so I think Caden would. I mean, yeah, sure, James has got all, like, the brawn and everything, but that doesn't necessarily mean you'll win a fist fight. 